What's up, you guys? It's Zach Jack Dan back with another Every Marvel Legends video. This time we're talking about every deluxe Marvel Legends. First deluxe figure we got was the X Men Archangel with the four different head sculpts and the Apocalypse Build a Figure extra hand that we can get. Next, we got as a deluxe, we got the giant man from Captain America Civil War, and they got him all crunched down in this package. Looks like he's at the airport, and they actually made this one more movie accurate than the actual build a figure was. Then we got the Target exclusive Red Hulk figure. Really impressed by this. It was a nice repaint and reuse of that mold for the Hulk. We got the Scarlett Johansson Black Widow figure. Got all these blast effects and hands and guns and whatnot. Got the figure stand as well. Got the Monster Venom repaint. Got the GameStop Game in Reverse Outback Hulk from the Avengers game. Next, we got the classic War Machine with the roadie head there from the 80s. Got all kinds of blast effects on this guy as well. There's the back of the package. And then we got the repaint, re release of the Age of Apocalypse Apocalypse figure here from the regular Apocalypse Builder figure. Don't mind this repaint at all. Got two head sculpts, one menacing, one smiling. Comes with that extra skull. Then we got the repaint of the Monster Venom Vidal figure again, this time as Toxin. This guy's got these crazy tentacles coming off his back. Got the green tongue, nice big head, red going into the black, very nice figure. So there are all of the deluxe figures that came in the deluxe boxes. Here's a kind of a wish list or most wanted list for what I'd love to see redone. Maybe the Strong Guy Builder figure, the Call of Obsidian, and even the Space Venom with a new head sculpt. I wouldn't mind those being done as deluxes as well. So these are actually kind of deluxe as well because they were Builder figures and they were repackaged. So this Toys R Us exclusive Evolution of Groot, in my opinion, would consider be, be considered deluxe. As well as the Walmart exclusive Thanos re-released the Builder figure, repainted. The Age of Ultron, Ultron, GameStop exclusive re-release -re for the Marvel first 10 years. The Guardians of the Galaxy Ronin from the first 10 years. The SDCC vintage retro Hulk figure with the pipe. The Grey Hulk on the vintage card. And then also the Kingpin on the Vintage card. I would also consider all those Deluxe, even though they weren't in that Deluxe box. There's all those loose. And in package. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave any kind of comments. Hit that notification bell so you're aware of any new videos that I have. Subscribe to the channel if you have any. Hit that thumbs up, and I'll talk to you guys later. Hey guys, don't forget to check me out on Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest. You can find all the photos that you want of these videos.